Yeah, I could have you as well. That's very firm, this other speaker. I don't want them. It's not a hundred percent, but it's yeah, because of the um the way this rubber surround sits, it's uh not quite as um allowed for this uh frame here. The rubber surround to look at it fold in more, but yeah. it turns out not to look very good. Yeah. It's a bit off off centering for the voice call, so yeah. it's got plenty of uh safe travel in there, so Looks a bit ugly, but I think it'll, it'll mould in with time. <coughs> Got my son looking at me there. He wants to see me do stuff, so I'll do some stuff in front of him. He can watch me. That one's done. That's still curing. Now to do this one, I've already prepared it and cleaned all the old stuff off it. And it's uh, put the new surround on, which is a bit of a challenge when you're doing it on the back of the cone. Got to get it exactly right. Takes a bit of work. Well, they're nice drivers, so. Eh? I finally refiled it, put it back together. That'll eventually remold itself back to shape, but that speaker's all done. Putting the back side of the cone adhesive from the suspension is more of a challenge than sticking it over the front of the cone. Putting it on the front of the cone is much more easier to get it perfect every time. But putting the suspension there around on the back of the cone. It's present quite a bit of a challenge with this rubber, rubber arm surround. I'm going to rerun a bead of glue over this and just pack it down, pat it down until it's all nice and evenly sealed all around, as I did with that speaker. It's bonded all the way around, but I'm going to put extra glue on here just to be on the safe side. And these little dents should come out after a while. There's a... Uh, original surrounds are pushed in more for some reason. There's a slightly got a bigger outer ring in them. It would have been a bit of too far out of shape and less likely to center the voice call, so I just did it like that. So looks kind of ugly, but I think it'll mold in with time. These, these sound nice. Yeah, they sound nice. Great sounding speakers. So they came out quite nice. Let that glue set, and I can uh, start enjoying these speakers and never get a chance. Well, I've got plenty of that glue left over, so I can do this uh, boom box next. So that'll be another another time. Anyway, that's come up quite nicely. Thanks for watching.